Hi, good afternoon. I'm Hisham from Text 5 and today we are at Canon Singapore office. Um, we're going to be uh, talking about, uh, we're going to be interviewing um, about the EOS, Canon EOS on the X. So here we have Andrew. Andrew, how are you? Hi, Hisham. Good, good. Thanks. Okay. Um, before we go on to the, uh, the interview proper, um, could you tell me more about uh, yourself and your role in the company? Ah, sure, sure. Um, I am the senior director and GM of the Consumer Imaging and Provision Group in the uh, that oversees the, both the consumer and the digital programs in the So that includes programs like the consumers, the printers, and the projectors. Canon EOS 1DX is mentioned as uh, combining high quality and high speed. Do you think Canon it will eat into the sales of the uh, Canon Body Mark Four? Canon as a whole, we produce a range of cameras to cater to different needs and wants of the market. And uh, in the high end market, we have both the, <coughs> the 1D series as well as the 1DS. Uh, with the EOS 1DX, we integrate both the, the, the features of the 1DS and 1D into one camera. That's where we have the 1DX comes in the last one. What kind of uh, photographers does uh, Canon Operation that we fully appreciate at 61 of the focus points? <laughs> um, throughout the years, I think Canon has been uh, known for uh, uh, being a leader in uh, sports photography. And uh, you see this at many sports events, and uh, those especially photographers who take action shots and see the white things. And in this respect, the same group of people will appreciate the money as the sports photographer, especially those who take action shots need to shoot fast but without sacrificing the quality. So we have the best of both speed as well as quality. So, um, going by the same line, if, if a photographer is still your base, he can still fully use the uh, more focusing and high quality as well. Yeah, yeah, sure he can. Although, uh, he can also use the 1PS, which is also he probably may not need the, the fast focus, but still it's nice to have. Yeah, it's, it's always good to have more Has this, uh, the new metric system, for um, Canon EOS 1DX, um, how much of an improvement would that give to photographers? Um, I know it's something you're so um, keen to know about it. Yeah, I wish I can quantify it for you, but because it is a completely new system, uh, so it's, it's, it's hard to, to benchmark it against what we have. Uh, but I can show you it's a completely new system which will. Uh, the additional of the joystick for the EOS 1DX, um, how much of uh, speed up or slow down? Will it slow down or will it help with the photographers? No, I think on the contrary, it's going to help photographers well, actually. <laughs> depending on which way, which way you hold it, you can actually, you know, if you go with just one hand, you don't have to use it to other finger to move it. So it's, I think it's the photographers will find this very, very useful for them. It's a very unique feature to have. Yeah. Yes. Um, how much of uh, feedback do you garner from the consumers as well as the professional photographers? Yeah. Um, or do you decide which way you um, We pride on ourselves on the... Uh, you know, we, we garner feedback from our users. We take feedback into consideration. Further to to find out really what the users are looking for, what they find useful. And for example, uh, before we launched the EOS 7, we, we spoke with more than 5,000 photographers to get feedback. 5,000? Yes. And then recently, when we launched the EOS 300, which is part of the CDI EOS system, uh, we got feedback from more than 6,000 industry professionals. So, 
why why is it that because one thing we get a lot of feedback from uh, users who use it, the people who matter most people who are using it in this number of um, do you have any additional thoughts on this or anything that you wish to add on to the EOS one days? Um, I think everyone in Singapore or anywhere else is anticipating this uh, EOS one days greatly. So I think some of our questions at the back of is when is it coming out? How much will it cost? So do you have anything to add? Um, we are all looking forward to, to this model arriving soon because uh, this going to be our first uh, full frame high speed uh, EOS model. I mean, it has the best of both, both worlds with high resolution. So I think it is something that a lot of photographers will appreciate and uh, will find it as a useful tool in, uh, in their jobs. Uh, so we should be expecting this sometime at the start of 2012. Pricing yet to be done. Okay, um, I think that will be all from uh, from me. Uh, thanks for responding to my questions. Thank you. Um, I suppose when when the product actually come out, then we will do another one as well. Sure. Sure. Thank you very much. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Thank you.